everybody. Welcome to your daily dose of dance. My name is Miss Emily. This is Miss Megan from socialdanceonline.com. We are going to be bringing you some intermediate East Coast swing moves. So we're going to start super simple with an inside turn and we're going to ramp it up from there. So if you find the beginning a little boring, just wait. We'll bring something to you later. All right. So we are going to start by showing you what all we're going to do. So we start with an inside turn, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, leader's breakthrough turn, triple step, triple step, we change the hand, triple step, triple step into American spin, triple step, triple step, rock step. Now we're gonna do our shoulder tap. So we have triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step with an inside turn, triple step to change the hand. Then we're gonna get a little bit more complicated and add a turn in the middle. So from here, rock step, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, American spin, and rock step. So let's go ahead and start with the inside turn first, and then we will, we're gonna quickly go over that, and then we'll do the leader's breakthrough turn. So inside turn, you've probably done this in beginner class. We are gonna do triple step, triple step and rock step. At this point, leaders, we are going to flip the hand. So we do an inside turn, a triple step, triple step and rock step. So you'll see that Miss Megan and I have switched places in that inside turn. Let's do it again. We have triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step and rock step. So we're doing a quarter turn for each of our triples. We'll do that a little bit slowly to break that down. So from our rock step, Rock, step, a triple step. So we've done a quarter turn. We're now gonna do another quarter turn, triple step to face our partner. Cool. One more time, then the leader's turn. And triple step, triple step, rock, step, triple step, triple step, and rock, step. Now, leaders, we get to turn and we're actually gonna change the hand when we do it. So we will show it first and then we'll break it down. Triple step, triple step, rock step. We're actually gonna do it right after our inside turn for the follower. So triple step, triple step, and rock step. Since we have this momentum, we're gonna step forward into our left arm. So triple step, she trails our waist, triple step, and then we catch with the other hand. So from the other side, this way. Inside turn first, rock step, Triple step, triple step, rock step. We go through the arm, trace the waist, and rock step. Yes? So followers, continue to do your uh, triple step, and you're following where your partner is leading. So do you think about anything for the breakthrough turn? Yes. So followers, um, when the leader goes through this breakthrough turn, um, they're going to place our hand on their waist, and then as we go around, you're going to make sure it stays at that same level so that they can find it on the way back through. Cool. So two more times, we'll do the inside turn and then the leader's breakthrough turn. Rock, step, triple step, triple step, rock, step, leader's breakthrough turn, and rock, step. Now, we are gonna go straight into, let's do it one more time, and then we'll talk about the American spin. <laughs> inside turn, from this side, rock, step, rock, step, triple step, triple step, Rock step, triple step, triple step, and rock step. Now from here, you could easily do another inside turn to change the hand. Rock step, triple step, triple step, and rock step. But instead, that'll come later. Now we're gonna do an Amer what we call an American spin. So it's a free spin for the follower, and the leader has to make sure to initiate that on the first triple. So if we do our rock step, rock step, we're both gonna triple in towards each other for triple step. So we have added energy going in towards this hand. We're gonna send our partner triple step and rock step. So once we have built up all of this uh, power, you don't need a lot of it, but a little bit of extra power. <laughs> rock step, triple step. The follower is then going to triple around, triple step, and we're back to our rock step together. So if we try that from this side, we'll just go from the rock step. So rock, step, triple step. She spins, triple step, and rock, step. 
So you do rotate quite a bit in one spot, followers. We wanted to give you patterns that you don't need a lot of space for since we're on lockdown for the coronavirus. So Forever. Forever. Um, but we wanted to give you something that you could do in a small amount of space, and this is a lot of rotation in a small space. So let's go do that again. We have rock, step, triple step. She spins triple step and rock, step. Cool. Any questions so far? All right. So let's go ahead and do all of those together. We have the inside turn for the follower. We have the breakthrough turn for the leader. And then we have the American spin for the follower. Here we go. And triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, and rock step. Cool. One more time. We're from this side. And triple step, triple step, rock step, inside turn, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, and rock step. All right. No more questions? No questions at all? All right. You all should get some questions ready. You should. Okay, so now we're going to, I guess, ramp it up since we don't have any questions. From this position, we are going to do a hand change. So we're going to do a leader's uh, breakthrough turn just for fun because we learned it and we can. So from here, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, and rock step. Now there's going to be a timing change. So we are going to take out the walk walk. We're going to do straight triples. So leaders, first you're going to go towards your partner with your left foot and then away from your partner with your right foot. Towards your partner with your left foot, away with your right foot. So followers, you're doing the same thing, obviously at different times. So let's just do that a couple of times from our rock step. So rock step back, we have rock step, we triple into our partner, away from our partner, in towards our partner, away from our partner. So followers and leaders, you can choose to do the tap if you would like. If you are not familiar with the partner that you're dancing with, it's probably a good idea just to kind of get into the groove of it. You do not have to as long as your lead with your right hand, her right hand, is solid. So let's try that a couple times. I like to do the tap because why not? But <laughs> we have rock, step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step. Now, however many times you do this, four is probably a good number. It has to be even, and you have to end leaders with your right foot. So no matter what exit you do, you have to make sure that you're on your right foot. Then, for now, we're gonna do an inside turn ending, triple step, triple step, and you're back to your regular hand hold. So let's go ahead and do that again. Without stopping, we're gonna do an inside turn to get out of it from our rock steps. We have rock step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, inside turn, triple step, and rock step. Cool, so from this position, you are making sure to lead your partner forward for the inside turn, triple step, triple step, and rock step. The nice thing about East Coast Swing is we are giving you pretty um, deliberate rotations, or we did earlier, but with social dancing in East Coast especially, if you go out on a different angle, it's not that big of a deal. So don't worry about having to go this way to end a pattern or this way to start a pattern. It all works out in the end. Um, anything for you, Ms. Megan? Um, yes, so followers, when we are doing the tap spin away, just make sure that you're staying connected into this hand so that you know what direction that you need to go. So we have rock, step. This hand's moving back to lead me to be open, and then it's going to lead in so that I can face my partner. And then it's going to go back out, and then it's going to go back in. And then I have to pay attention to the end here because it's going to be a bigger movement to go triple step and underneath for the inside turn. Cool, so let's try that whole thing. We'll do the inside turn exit, as well as the leader's breakthrough turn entrance. 
which is making, just doing, you know, hand jive. So from her rock step, we have rock step leaders break through turn to change the hand, rock step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, inside turn, triple step, and rock step. All right, question? Yay! Going back to the American spin. Yes. Okay. Can you cover the connection uh, for the rock step in order to do that spin a little bit more? Yes, sure. So the question was, uh, can we go over the rock. energy in the rock step before the American spin in more detail? So from here, we have our handshake hold. Yes, we're not supposed to handshake. We're gonna. I don't know if we could. We could lead the pattern that way, though. Elbow bump. But for this pattern, oh, stop, Benjamin. From <laughs> here, we have our, we'll just do a triple. So we have triple step, triple step, rock step. So I'm actually sending my energy through uh, my elbow to her elbow. Triple step forward. <laughs> We're going to do that again. So rock step, rock step, triple step. So I am feeling a very forward energy for both of us in order to start that rotation. So we, ha we both have that triple forward, we're on a slight diagonal, so this arm is in between us, and then as the follower goes into the turn, triple step, that should be all the momentum that she needs. So on the actual rock step, it's in the waist connection though, it's not a pattern? Yeah. Correct, yes, sorry. So from here, the, there is an away connection on the rock step, rock step, but then that changes when we do the triple step, trip, Full step. So the rock step is away, rock step, and the triple is forward. Cool. Let's do it one more time from this side. The whole thing? Yes. Gotcha. <laughs> so leaders break through turn into our hand change. We'll do the shoulder taps in a circle, and then we will do the inside turn exit. All right. So leaders break through turn, rock step first, rock step, triple step, Triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, inside turn, triple step, and rock step. All right, so now we're going to do a different exit because you know the American spin, so why not? From here, we're just going to go, let's assume that we've already done the leader's breakthrough turn. We've changed the hand, so we're going to do our rock step. We have rock step. Triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step. So that American spin that we just talked about, triple step. We have that same connection. So we can do an American spin, triple step, and we're back to our regular hand hold. One more time, maybe a couple more times from this side. We have the handshake hold, and then we'll do the whole thing from the top to change the hand. So rock step first, rock. Step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, and rock step. So again, leaders, make sure that you're finishing those triples, you're finishing that part of the move with your right foot so that you can use the first triple with your left foot, triple step, to start the American spin, triple step, and then you're back to your normal timing. Cool. Let's do that whole thing. So inside, or sorry, we could do an inside turn. We could. Inside turn, leader's breakthrough turn, into the shoulder taps, and then the American spin ending. Here we go. Rock, step, triple step, triple step, rock, step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, and rock, step. Cool. So you'll notice that I actually bypass part of the basic. As soon as Megan did the inside turn, rock, step, triple step, I went straight into triple step, my breakthrough turn. So if you want to take some of those triples out, you can combine those two moves and it makes it look a little cooler. Any questions? Nope. All right. So now we're going to go into a different set of shoulder taps <laughs> with a walk walk in between. So pretty cool. We're gonna start with a handshake hold because that's how we get into it again. And a rock step. So rock step, triple step, 
triple step. Now, can, instead of continuing on with our triples, we're gonna do our walk walks or our normal timing. Walk, walk, triple step, triple step, walk, walk. Let's just do that much from this side. So we rock step back. Rock, step, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, triple step, and walk, walk. Cool. So let's break that down a little bit for the leaders and followers, and then we will try it all together with the ending as well. So from here, we have our rock step. We have rock step. We're gonna start the same way that we did the other one. We have a triple, triple step, triple step. But right here, this arm is gonna go down and up to, to uh, turn the follower. So we have a walk, walk. Now we are ready to do the triple again. Triple step, triple step, and a walk, walk. Now, as you can see, when we do it again, our hand is gonna be right in the middle again, so we can either do, actually for tonight, we're just gonna do an American spin. <laughs> so from this position, we are set up perfectly to do that triple forward, triple step, triple step, and rock step. So we did that from the handshake hold into the ending. We have two turns, and then we're gonna do the American spin. Cool, so we have our rock step, rock step, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, American spin, and walk, walk. So as you may not be able to see, so let's go ahead and break this down. When we do our, um, the turn, make sure leaders that you are actually, the palm is to the sky, we are lifting up and around, and then we come back down. Followers, do not help. It makes it so much harder. Don't do it. We all want to, but don't do it. Pretty much just a flat palm so that the leader, as they go around, they can come back around to the proper side of your hand. Yes. Please and thank you. So slowly, let's go ahead and do this again from our rock step. We have rock step, triple step, triple step. We lift walk walk then we're going to bring that hand back down triple step triple step walk walk then our hand is back down again to do the american spin triple step triple step and rock step anything to add for the turn um followers when you're led in a turn make sure that you're following the speed of in which the leader leads you in that spin it's not necessarily a spin, it could be a turn, and the difference is sometimes they're not as fast. Spins tend to be tighter, maybe, in my definition. Probably not a solid definition there, but it works. Um, so this is not a fast turn. So we have trip, uh, rock step, sorry. <laughs> and again, we have rock step, triple step, triple step. This is just a walk, walk. You're just walking under for walk, walk. So don't turn too fast because then the leader's not going to be able to lead the next thing. So one of the things that you can kind of go back to is always revert back to your basic timing. So whatever dance you're doing, followers, if you don't know what's coming next, always go back to your basic timing. So one of the things for the other one, the straight triples, I'm actually leading and keeping my arm low the entire time. So all of that is pretty much equal as far as the movements go. This one with the turn, sorry, was my This one for the turn, the arm goes down and up, but we haven't, there's nothing that's told you that anything's gonna change timing wise. So go ahead and go revert back to your walk walks or what would have been your rock steps, and you should be good to go as far as timing. So, leaders, that being said, you're in charge of timing. So, once you've done your rock step, we have rock step, triple step, triple step. Make sure that this takes that entire time. Walk, walk, and you're ready to go. Triple step, triple step, walk, walk. Cool? Okay, so let's do that one more time from this side, then we will cover everything that we did, and we'll go from there. Uh, inside turn, got it. Triple step, triple step, rock step, 
triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, American spin, and walk, walk. All right. Questions, Benjamin? All right. We do like questions. We do. Actually, that being said, Megan and I are doing a Q&A on Saturday. So if you have any questions, you can either email them or put them in the link, not the link, the little chat thing in Facebook or YouTube, and we'll take them and make sure that we cover them on Saturday. Um, so tune in for that as well. Let's go ahead and do this one more time from this side, and then we'll go through everything. Okay. Inside turn, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, triple step, and rock step. I just want to have a little <laughs> swipe the curtain. Curtain. Curtain call. Okay. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> so now let's go ahead and do everything. We have the inside turn. I'm going to bypass doing another basic and do, go directly into the leader's uh, breakthrough turn to change the hand. Then we have the American spin. We have the first set of shoulder taps, which we'll do an inside turn exit just to kind of show the difference. And then we'll do the second set with the walk walks and the spins in between with an American spin exit. Whew, here we go. Inside turn, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, leader's breakthrough turn, rock step, American spin, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, rock step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, and rock step. Then we had our second set of step taps with the turn in the middle, so keeping the same timing. We're just gonna start with our handshake hold. We have rock step, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, triple step, triple step, walk, walk, American spin, triple step, and rock step. All right, if we don't have any questions, I think we're gonna sign out for this evening. So if you um, aren't watching this live, we are on lockdown from the coronavirus and we are hoping that everybody is doing their part and staying home and staying well and staying safe, except for us, except for us. Uh, because we wanted to bring you your daily dose of dance every day. So every day except for Sunday, we are here hanging out with you. Thanks for hanging out with us. Uh, we will be back in just a few minutes. I made a West Coast Swing line dance, so come back and join us for that. Thanks, guys.